Hello and welcome to my first video episode thing in this game called Whoopo. I have no idea what this game is. I have no idea what is going on in the background. I have no idea what's going on whatsoever. Atlantis played this game and she said it was hilarious. And so she bought it for me, saying that I must play it. And uh guess I'm playing it now. <laughs> Why? Okay, so, um, yeah. She wanted to see my reaction to it, so, um, guess I'm gonna press new game and see what on earth is gonna happen. Um, play the game as intended, yes, normal mode, let's go. Well, Wormhouse entrance. I have no idea what this is. I have no idea what type of game this is either. Oh. Yeah, here I am again. So what did you need? The phone rang, apparently. Who is this? Nothing. Yeah, I'm gonna see who is this. <laughs> well. This is Carlo from the service desk downstairs. <laughs> okay. Hey, don't play dumb with me. You just called me 20 seconds ago. <laughs> well. Oh, right. No, I didn't. Uh, I'm just gonna play around long here. Alright. Oh, no joking. Did you lose your senses? Uh, he's mean. What room number? What room number is this? I write everything down, you know. Oh, it's you. <laughs> well, judging by the last 10th... 101,701 times you called me, I'm guessing you're going to order ice cream again. <laughs> order ice cream. Okay. I want ice cream. Okay. Well, too bad, pal. Just like the last time we spoke, the transporting system doesn't work anymore. So we're going to have to come downstairs to get your ice cream. Okay, then. I'm not sure when you left your room for the last time, you know, since my last outburst. So I'm just going to say this. You can move with A and D and jump with W. Oh, and you can duck and dive underwater with S. Okay. Yeah, that was weird. Hmm, see what that says. Okay, good. Okay, what? Okay, um, I'm a tiny snowball. It would seem. Oh, yay! A balcony! Okay. That's interesting. Okay, moving on. So I'm supposed to go downstairs, apparently. I see a lift. What does this do? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, hey. Haven't seen you face in a while. To which floor would you like to go? Floor one. Let's go to floor one. Okay. Oh, no. I might have overheard your conversation on the phone. And I just want to say that Carlo, the woman from the service desk, might sound incredible to me. Incredibly mean, but he's actually a great worm. Since, since everyone is leaving, Carlo is taking over so many tasks. Without him, the worm house simply wouldn't survive. <laughs> Still mean. Oh, okay. Um, I'm glad you understand. I feel bad for him sometimes. Well, have fun, buddy. Okay. Well, I can't enter that place, so I guess I'm going out the other side. Over here. I guess that's him? I don't know. I forgot how to do a double jump. <laughs> you jump twice. Oh, that's doable. Yay. Okay. Here's how one makes paintings here. Do you know where to see them? Oh, Renzo. Alright. Oh, hey. <laughs> So you want your ice cream, huh? Ice cream, please. Okay. But, promise me one thing. I still haven't forgotten the last time you ate ice cream. And I'm pretty sure you haven't forgotten my outburst. But to be fair, you messed up the entire whole way. Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> so please, take the ice cream back to your room and eat it there. Without leaking the whole thing through the warm houses. 
No problem. Okay. Sure thing. I'm serious. Don't even mess with this time. Eat ice cream inside your room. Don't worry. I got this. I got this. I know what I'm doing. Yay. Ice cream. I'll keep an eye on you. Yay. Get inside your room to eat rice ice cream. Okay. I'm spilling this everywhere. <laughs> well. Uh, he's not gonna be happy about this. <laughs> Do you think I'll have time to sleep anytime soon? Of course. I guess. Really? Hey, <laughs> hey. I'm looking forward to it. Thanks for giving me hope. That's very kind of you. Yay! Okay. I'm spilling this everywhere. Oh no. <laughs> well. <laughs> I told you not to spill your ice cream through the, whole, the hallway. For once could you make my life a little easier. <laughs> I can't. That's it. I've had enough. Guards, throw this one from the balcony. Wait, what? Has room for this kind of behavior. No, not the balcony. I like that balcony, though. No. Meh. Leave me alone. Meh. Well. Aha. Uh -huh. Well. Hmm. Wow. Ow. Oh. I thought he might have, might have some nice items. No, leave me alone. Leave me alone. A television? I've never been, I'll never be bored again. I don't even care that nobody visits my store anymore. Oh well, time to run. Get back here. Get my television. You thief. Get back here. The room garden. Okay. What is this? I don't know what this is, but okay. I see a house. Dear friends, I moved to a different location. So bird wouldn't stop making annoying noises. Okay. Okay, so I have to find the other sweeter, whoever that is. How do I... Can I go underwater? Yes, I can. Cool. Oh, well, hey there. A visitor. Finally. I didn't expect it would take so long before Gums found my new house. Hmm. I don't think I've met you before. Let me introduce myself. I am the eldest sweeter. And I know everything. How do I get home? Hmm. You want to get back to the warm house, you say? I will tell you how to do that, but only after you've sat down for a nice story. Okay. Come on, you don't want to miss an opportunity to gain wisdom, do you? Let's go inside to start the projector. Okay. Do you have any film strips? Well, to tell a story the right way, I need a film strip. <laughs> hmm. I guess I can give you a film strip for free. Yay! Gimme. Congratulations on your first film strip. Let's open your inventory by pressing tab. I have an inventory? Oh. Okay. Cool. Well, well done. Thank you. So start playing. Go ahead. And then... Walk to the protector and click on it. Hold on. Aha! Did it. Okay. Oh my! This film strip tells us about the very early years of the existence of the world. The first steps in this planet were set by four different races. As you can see, our people are one of them. Women are the most intelligent kind, but also the most lacking in abilities. They are known for, well, you know, they pretty much rule the planet now. Even without any special skills, we women managed to become the most powerful race by building and wearing all sorts of equipment. And as you already guessed, we were all there. we've also been the most fashionable race since day one. Okay, it's a slide of a plotter. 
Plazas are known for their ability to carry lots of water. They are also known for being the most friendly race. After the Fnaka Wars, they became the gardeners of the Wombs. Now that's more like it. Mm -hmm. Look, here's a slide of the Splank Hacker. What on earth are these names? Splank Hackers might not be the smartest race, but they are certainly one of the most practical ones. They are known for their ability to have a Splank. Splank is a very powerful material, and most of the womb house was built with it. Okay, and at least here's a slide of a Fnacker. Bleh, I still can't stand those faces. <laughs> Fnackers were known for their ability to throw up rocks. Disgusting, yeah, I agree, that's pretty disgusting. That also got a hurt for the throat. They were very aggressive, and they didn't want to share the world with the other races. That explains why the Fnacker War started. But after the war, there was a single Fnacker left. Exactly. No mercy for these ugly fellows. And apparently my guy is leaving. Okay. Cool. Oh, how nice. Here's a picture of them all lined up. Worms, Blusses, Splank Anchors, and Fnackers. Cool. That was a nice piece of story, wasn't it? Indeed. Oh, right. You wanted to get out of that place and go back to your room in the worm house. Well, the truth is, it would be very dangerous. You see, normally you'd be able to walk in and out of this place through the kitchen, but for some reason the door's locked. And I can hear some strange noises coming from the kitchen. Anyways, you're going to have to find the underground tunnel to get back to the worm house. But finding the tunnel could be a really could be really difficult. Also, there seems to be a group of strange looking creatures high up in the trees. They seem kind of friendly though. I just don't know what to think of them. But just in case they are planning to harm you, I will give you a weapon to defend yourself. There you go. What is this? Equipping it is easy. It's almost exactly like equipping a film strip. Only this time, you will open the blue icon in your inventory. Let's have to open your inventory. <laughs> okay. Okay. Easy, right? You can equip every item to acquire in your journey. The item might just give you is a gum gun. Only left, left mouse button will make you continue to loop gum gum balls towards your cursor. So if anything on your path is unfriendly, give it a gum gum shower. Okay. Now it's time for you to get back to the worm house. Good luck. Um. Well then. How do I get up from here? Oh, the water. Right. Okay, so... Okay, apparently I'm going over here. Seems like I'm following this bird. Wait, where's the old sweeter? I feel like that sign might explain what happened to him. So, can you read signs? Yes. Yay! What does the sign say? Well, the sweeter moved because of you. Uh, yeah, let's not lie, let's just be straight. Well, that's not completely unexpected. <laughs> Our relationship is very, very complicated. I really tried to be his friend, but I can't help myself from yelling where every few seconds. <laughs> he really hates the where's, but after a while, I started enjoying that. Hey, what about you? What's your name? My name is... Scallywag. Well, love that name. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. So I might as well tell you what I'm useful for. Okay, I spent a lot of time around the Alice Wiener, so I know many things now too. You can equip me just like any other item in the game. Whenever I see something I have some information about, I'll spread my wings. If you click on me then, I'll start talking. Okay, cool. Woo! Let's get out of this dump. Yes. Okay. So. I have a, I have a bird on my head. And I have a feeling that I should get my gun out. Just in case. Okay, so I cannot go that way. I'm gonna try and go the other way and see what happens. Ha, ha. 
So. Hold on. I will get this eventually. There we go. Like that. Aha! Hold on. There's something here. Can I not enter the house? Hmm. It's only equipped a bird. to do here. something I'm missing of course. Can I go down the aha go down the chimney. Knew it. Knew there was something. Okay. I'm gonna take my gun out just in case. Okay, let's break these things. I don't know what they are, but there's something. I see something here. What is this? Don't know what that is, but it's a thing. It's a thing and I'm taking it. Don't know how to get up there. Hmm. Looks like some ancient temple thing. Temple ruins. Okay. I don't like the look of this place. Oh, hold on a second. Was this the guy that stole my TV? Get back here. Hmm. He will not. Ah! Okay. Yeah. Okay, this is gonna be rather difficult. Yeah, that's gonna be near. Hmm. Aha. Okay. Guess I'm going up here. Okay, what's up here then? Not a place I want to go, I don't think. I think I want to keep going to the... Oh no, I just broke the thing. Okay. Whee! Well, okay, that... I failed. Okay. One up here. Jump. Jump. And... Jump! Okay. Nasty worms, get gummed. Haha. <laughs> okay, cool. I do not like caves. Haha. <laughs> Haha. Busted, buddy. Oh, good. You're a worm. Yes. What else? Yeah, I guess I've been a bit paranoid for a while. You see, this pot helmet thing I found stuck, stuck in the mud at the sinkhole. For some reason, it reminds me of nothing. It reminds me of Fnacus. <laughs> okay. I know they were all thrown into the sinkhole. I keep dreaming that they're going to climb back up or something. I mean, nobody knows what at the bottom of the sinkhole. So what if that giant Pauline that bounces them back up? Calm down, buddy. What if they're already here? No. They could be. We need to hide. Don't be ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous. You're right. Giant trampoline is ridiculous. Yes, legs have been dealt with a long time ago. We have nothing to worry about. Maybe you should take the pot helmet from me. Yes, it's only going to make me scared. Go ahead and take it. Why did the music just stop? I don't like this. Okay. Nothing bad happened. Thank you for making me feel better. You're a very kind worm. Yay. Cool. Now what? What does this say? Warning. The sinkhole ahead. Uh, guess I'm going towards the sinkhole, because why not? I don't like this music. What is that? That's a 
Duh. Okay, well. I guess that's a snagger. I have no idea. Okay. Eat gum or something. I don't know. <laughs> okay. This is not impossible. This is very possible doing. I think it would be easier with a controller, to be honest, this game, maybe. Ow. You know, I might fail this game. Ow. I have lost significantly a lot of health. Die, beast. Ow. I have been damaged. I refuse to stick around to die. And let's start playing this game to lose. Okay. We almost got him. Almost got him. Just gotta get rid of all this stupid stones he spits out. Where you at, bud? Where you at? Where you at? Die. Die, you thing. Wee. Got him. Whew. Okay. I guess that was a Fnecker. Maybe. Don't know why I'm going this way, to be honest. Why am I even going down here? Okay. The bird is saving me. Good. Are you out of your mind, Scalawag? I guess I am. Yeah, you know what? Let's get out of here. <laughs> Let's get out of here and uh, see if we can get back to where we came from. And uh, see what's up. If we can get back. That's the thing. It's so nice and quiet here. Yay! Alright. Temple ruins. That's cool. Nice and peaceful here. I have no idea if there's anything else I'm supposed to do with the temple. I don't think so. Oh, are you kidding me? Need to get through that again. Can I get up there? Can I? Nope. Okay. Oh! That's a saving feature. Okay, that's cool. Okay. Well then. Cool. I can still not... Oh, wait a second. There's a guy up there. Ahoy there! How'd you end up there, Wump? You got thrown out? Like Carlo? The services, Wump? Don't worry. I can open the door for you. One sec. Yay! Ah. What is this? Sorry. The door is blocked by something. I can't get inside either. What do we do? Hmm. I guess we can always ask the all the sweeter. He lives somewhere here. But not too long ago he moved to a different location because some bird was getting on his nerves. They just kept making just kept making the same nose noise over and over again and when the whenever the other sweeter went out the bird followed him. I guess the other sweeter moved to a location where the bird can't follow him. Yes. That is very true. Um guess I'll go talk to him. I think we're gonna do that in the next video if I do choose to continue this thing. Because I think I'm gonna end it here. Um just wanted to try the game. It's actually pretty funny and enjoyable and very very weird. So um yeah. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't yet, and enable those notifications. And until when you're watching this, I hope you enjoyed my uh Well, my my guy is now sleeping. Okay, well, I guess I'll leave him to it. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like. Feel free to join my Discord server, link down below. And uh, be sure to follow me on Twitter as well, link down below in the description. Also, check out Atalantis' channel out, link down below in the description, because he did buy this game for me. I am grateful for that. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed. And well, if this video gets enough likes, then I'll uh, I guess I'll do an episode too. 
let's see, let's say five likes. Five likes and I'll do an episode two of this. But yeah, hope you enjoyed and hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Bye.